two, one. Hello! Yay! Hi! Yeah! What's up? Woo! Yeah! Woo! Welcome to Color Circuit. You're listening and or watching and or streaming and or live streaming <laughs> the Color Circuit Circuit Board Podcast. That's, That's right. True. That's right. Yes, That's this right. is episode one of the Circuit Board Podcast, which includes myself, Dylan. Uh, Kendra. That's S me. <laughs> Scott. I won't tell you which one is him. <laughs> and uh, Bon. Because that, that'll be left as a mystery also. Yeah. Great. Yeah. So thank you for tuning into the podcast, Facebook, Twitch, or YouTube. Uh, we're doing all of them. And also on iTunes later. Not now, but later. Not iTunes now. later. iTunes yes. and audio version. This is true. Uh, so what is the point of this podcast, guys? Uh, make this? Shoot. Um, um, it's kind of just a podcast of uh, all of us getting together and chatting about how we started and what's going on with our week. Kind of just updates in our life. Yeah. 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 It'll be... Uh, you know, it'll take on different forms. We'll, you know, you'll get to know us a lot better if you don't know us now. Like, I mean, we're basically sharing it to all of our friends now. So yeah. my people know who I am, but they don't know who these people are. And know. vice versa. Like, everybody's kind of just meeting in the middle. And what so do you mean your people? My people? Yeah. People yeah. that... It's a race thing? Only... Like, they wouldn't know like a, a Dylan or Bond? Maybe yeah. not. Some of these people. No, no, no. I, I, <laughs> I, I know a, a, a diverse, a diverse, a diverse group of people <laughs> that love and respect all different creeds, colors, what have you. All of my friends, they only like one creed, color, or what have you. That's so right. That's and that's how they will meet me. This is true. This podcast. That's, that's the, the focus of all that's this. perfect. Yeah. I think yeah. I'm the token Asian in like every group, so I don't. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. We oh, wait, yeah, that's right. This is different, yeah. yeah. Like lucky it. enough, half, half Jap is what I am. To have Ooh. two token Asian people. <laughs> <laughs> Doing most of the tech work, by the way. Yes. <laughs> it, hey. Kendra, you're getting there. Kendra's getting there. I've, I've, getting been, close. I've been moving up well. in the ranks. <laughs> <laughs> inaugural, or not inaugural, but uh, uh, that's a lot of lipstick on your cup. Uh, on or, your cup. Oh, <laughs> yeah, technically it's all, yeah, let's go to the lipstick uh, cam. Lipstick cam? It's actually a dead dad cam, but you can uh, use it as lipstick yeah. cam. Switching up today. Um, going to... <laughs> you know, it's, it's like hardly even... It's pretty running. washed out. Yeah. yeah. It's just not... But it's gross is all we want you to know. Yeah. yeah, but it looks great on my lips. It's so right girly. Oh, and it just gets good. everywhere. Some good looking lips. You just, you shine so much on the podcast. You uh, seem so like... It might be the skin. I know I'm like glowing. It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Senpai, senpai. Anywho. <laughs> Scott, who are you? Why do we care about you? Well, um, I can't answer that question. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I can do the first part of that question. I can tell you who I am. I don't know why you would care about me. Um, I am Scott Brown, and I, you know, we all met each other doing comedy and improv in, in town, and... I have a radio background. I have a podcasting background. This live streaming thing is new and foreign to me, and because it's new and foreign, I do not like it. <laughs> it takes too effing long to set up. It's amazing. I like the results, but gee whiz. That's all I'm saying. That's it. Gee whiz. <laughs> gee whiz. Man. Lookers. But I like it so far, and I want to keep doing it. Um... Yeah, and that's that's kind of me, and we'll find out more about me as as time passes by us, as we grow older, as we go through <laughs> almost hundreds of episodes, hundreds of episodes. This is just one <laughs> of a billion podcast episodes <laughs> where we will delve deep yeah. into all of and where we start to wonder all of life's mysteries and all of our personal mysteries and why we are the way we are. I'm done. That's what we're going to find out. <laughs> That's right. That's a lot of information. That's right. So much. Stephen Hawking hasn't figured that out. No, and he's a very smart man. I definitely want Isn't us he? to go down the line, but first, uh, Rachel Brown. Oh, my uh, sister. Yeah. I know her. Oh. They, they miss you at Los Cuates. Okay, yeah. What's I, a Los Cuates? A oh. Los Cuates is one of the longest-running Mexican restaurants here in Albuquerque. Uh, my aunt and uncle Bob and Jenny. God, I'm sorry I asked. Not respectively. <laughs> um <laughs> Not flip, respectively. Flip those names. Unrespectively. Unrespectively, that's right. Disrespectfully. <laughs> my aunt and uncle, Bob and Jenny, disrespectfully. 
That's how that sentence goes. Um, <laughs> they just got into town today, and so um, oh, and you're here. I'm here. I was wow. gonna go out. I, I wanted to start at um, six, and it is now seven sixteen. <laughs> um, you know, it's, we, we've learned something about you, and that uh, you are a terrible nephew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I stretch myself too thin as a nephew, and because. My aunt and uncle don't live here all the time. I'm not used to being a nephew. And they so, probably worry if you eat or not. Yeah. No, I will eat. I have I have uh, peach rings. By the way, I've I been have... kind of staring at those. Can I have Would one? you like some? Yeah. Yeah, yeah they're one. for everybody else. I have, like, Sour Patch Kids. Oh, um, I'll take some Sour Patch Yeah, Kids. These, these streaming events are a really good Sugar. excuse for snacks. <laughs> yeah. Just I'm all the snacks. Really getting Junk food snacks. is just a, a steady part of our diet at this point in our lives. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it tends to go downhill. Yeah. Um, yeah. Also, uh, from Wesley on Facebook, Wesley Swedenberg. <laughs> I don't know, that, old, that old goof. That goof. He says, I'm a duck. Fucking Wesley. <laughs> uh, to which I would like to say, Wesley, I'm a bird. I'm a big, 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 big bird. He'll get it. Uh, he'll yeah, also he'll get okay this. Uh, I was on right stage now. with him once. Uh, Wesley is a local improviser, as, as am I. And uh, I went and sat down, like in a jacuzzi for a scene, and mm -hmm. Duck, Duck, Wes came behind me and put his arms uh, over my shoulders, and I, I didn't know what he was going to say, and he went, quack, I'm a duck. <laughs> and that, I, it didn't go anywhere, mm -hmm. but it was one of my favorite scenes. Was uh, that a rehearsal or a show? I feel like it was a show. Yeah. It was a show, yeah. Yeah, I remember being on the I back was gonna line. Be the, I was going to be the kid <laughs> that was going into the jacuzzi that was being seduced by his neighbor, Right, I think. Yeah, that yeah, sounds yeah. about right. That sounds like something that so would thank happen. You, you know, why is the shoulders. camera on me still? Let's move it to... Kendra, why don't you talk about yourself? Yes, what is, what is <laughs> your life? <laughs> <laughs> Take a back seat, boys. <laughs> Kendra's going to talk for a while. That's um, a golden hey, girl of the show. I'm Kendra. That's right. You heard it. Here first, first on Color Circuit. <laughs> She's also the only female of Color Circuit board. Yeah. Uh, you heard it here first. It does does that matter? Um, yeah, because I see genders. Okay. I don't see colors, <laughs> I don't see sexualities, but I see a hell lot like, of genders. I see a lot of genders. A lot and of genders. And the number two. Actually, <laughs> That was weird. And the number two. <laughs> there, this somebody, to did, by... somebody made a list of genders, and it's like 43 or something. Like yeah, the official. I, I heard about that. Yeah. Crazy. That's, um, a lot of, that's a lot. This is my time. I don't want to talk about that. I want to talk about my shirt. Oh, um, yeah. So it is uh, May the 4th. <laughs> that's right. I forgot about that. This is how I show <laughs> it up. <laughs> uh, so maybe Don't stand up. Just stretch your shirt up. <laughs> So May the, the fourth be with you. That's right. Um, <laughs> did you see our set deck? Yeah, we have a. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Little toy. Oh, baby. We were playing with it before you guys got here. It actually like. We'll yeah, it's cool. Use it. Oh my god. I'm so jealous. I also have a voice activated R two D two that can like walk around walk How around the room. It? It's like uh, like that tall. Wait, you uh, said it walks can, around. Uh, could you yeah. like do that in a way that people could understand? Because only I saw that. Two feet. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what do you have for me? Um, yeah. Uh, me. Why, why do I do Color Circuit? Color it was... Cir Color Circuit started because uh, I asked Dylan if he would like to do a podcast together. Mm -hmm. um, and instead he was like, well, how about we do this other thing that I've been wanting to do? <laughs> <laughs> that no. Like our relationship. <laughs> yeah. And, Actually, uh, let's talk about how we met, and then we can go into that. Okay. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is our meeting zone. Okay. I think. This is scoundrel cam. Uh, so uh, I met you a couple times. I actually first met you when you were dressed as Eleven from Stranger Things. Stranger yeah, Things that's right, for Halloween. Uh, this is gonna drive me nuts. I don't think the video synced up, but whatever. Um. You were dressed as eleven, and I don't think you remember me. No, I, I've, I've told you that before. Tiffany, that I didn't remember that night. Yeah, you didn't. Uh, Tiffany remembers, or Tiffany introduced you to me and Jessica, and you were with Royal, I believe. Yeah. Um, in front of Valerie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And um, then I met you again, probably while you were doing a rumble thingy. I, I probably ran into you. Oh, I remember. Uh, you're at your place, at your current place that you live at. Um, 
you guys were doing that mystery science theater type of show. Wait, you house. were there? I was there. <laughs> I met you uh, that night. I don't think we actually were introduced, I don't though. remember that. I'm Something so sorry. So now you know okay, how it so feels, I, Dylan. I met my, her like four times. I would do my a freaking first... play with you, and you didn't have no idea. I was. A, you was drove saying. me to the play. <laughs> And you were like, Kevin was that, Jessica was that, and somebody else. Scott, who was it? Remember. You didn't, I, I didn't make an fully impression, expected apparently. you to like touch my thigh or something during the play, and it didn't happen, so. Thought I did. Not memorable. Made a mistake. Yeah, no, that's fair. Made a mistake. Uh, so I first, met you four times, and you don't first, remember. Yeah, the first meeting that I remember was at Open Source Comedy, mm -hmm. and you were there for a workshop. Mm -hmm. A stand-up workshop. Uh, yep, hosted by Sarah Kennedy. And we just started chatting, and you mentioned puppets. Yes. And my reaction was, oh, my God. Oh, as how you can did see, I not meet you uh, in the back of, behind us. Uh, Everyone else just went away. And yeah, it was yeah. just you and I, like I in the room. It was like a of the Red Sea, and you and I are on both ends. Mm -hmm. I, is that a good metaphor for that? I don't, sure. Yeah. Uh, so, yes, and then we're like, yes, let's do this puppet thing. So that's something that we're, you should look forward to, is that we're going to be doing a puppet. Yeah, there are puppets. except that the poor puppets have been kind There's of a puppet uh, up there. disregarded. For yeah. a while. Yeah. No, there's one over by Bond. On there's one. Yeah. And then there's another up uh, there. God, there it's hard go. to see. Anyways, Maria Hanford. Maria Hanford. I never named our other one. But anyways. So yeah, then 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 what? Uh then the, oh, then I invited you to do a Star Wars role playing game with that's me. That's true. A while ago. And that's that's kind of how this actually got started, is that you and I saw the potential in working together, mm -hmm. maybe doing a podcast with uh traveling comedians. And then I said, uh, fuck your idea. <laughs> let's, uh, let's create a channel where we have to do a million more things. Yeah. yeah, yeah and podcasting right. will be 1% of it. Exactly. And this yeah. is the first podcast, and it's not the podcast I'm you wanted podcast to do in the first place. No. <laughs> I definitely didn't want to be sitting with you guys. Five. That's for sure. Woo! But what do you think? Maybe in a month or so we'll have our, our podcast off the ground? Yeah. Yeah. Because you guys want to do guests. You want to, like, interview, we comedians, interview comedians and comedians. Comedians. Yeah. Traveling comedians. Traveling comedians. Yeah. That's the idea. So, anyways, that's how you and I met. Yeah. Right? And, yeah. And that's how Color Circuit was birthed. It was birthed. It was born. you guys. It was, it was ideaed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> I've grown to... I've grown to... Uh, kind of like you, I guess. Yeah. Um, it's a rough start. Kind of like the channel. Yeah, we, uh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that I like you. You likes a strong word. Yeah, uh, but I'm. I'm happy that uh, you have all this equipment. And I'm happy that <laughs> you could be just a pretty face. For the <laughs> you know, it's mutual our love. It's on the same level. It's on like the same yeah, level. it's the same superficial uh, <laughs> bullshit <laughs> level. You got the pretty face. I got the computers. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Ha cha cha. Wow. <laughs> all. <laughs> all right. Bond cam. Is it Bond cam? Is it Bond cam time? It's Bond time. Dylan cam. Did we not do Dylan cam yet? Oh. That was uh, kind of both y'all. Both of our cam. At okay. least we'll go more into depth of our. Uh, I want to. We, we should get into our professions at some point. Okay. Sure. okay. About what sure. we do. Uh, you okay. just want to talk uh, about so much to do. The fact that I'm the only successful person in the room. That's uh, terrifying. Yeah. That's another that's wow. another strong that's word, successful. Yeah. Uh, it's terrifying. Yeah, let's talk about you, Bon. <laughs> uh, before we talk about Bon, uh, who does have a legendary voice, uh, I'd also like to point out that Julian Mendez said ah. legendary voice that is Scott's. Uh, mm, me, yes, him and I yes. go way back all the way to 91.5 KRUX in Las Cruces, New Mexico. Uh, we did a morning show together called Hungover. It nice. was his baby, and I came on it as a co-host thing, and and uh, we did that for a while. And now he's up here uh, doing film. He's doing some film stuff. So check out Julian Mendez, Julian Mendez. and uh, he's on uh, he's on uh, Instagram. He's been he posts like little snippets. I haven't seen like a full thing, but like short films, yeah. elaborate things. Um, so yeah, uh, good guy, good guy. Him. He's also uh, Albuquerque's best bartender. Cool. As far as Albuquerque the magazine is concerned, like many years in a oh, row. Oh, really? He's been voted. Wow. Yes. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So that does means... he do the flips and? Yeah, the I next bet. Time I've, I've never seen him in action. Yeah. Okay. But I imagine so. Speaking <laughs> of action. Well, that let's. Get action. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. I should do this. Yeah. Um, hey Bon. Yeah, I'm Bon. bon. Uh, this I met bon. everyone pretty much bon. through Kendra, and uh, through the Cthulhu stream that you guys actually. Oh, not Cthulhu. Was it the? the I think Star the Star Wars, Wars one. Yeah. Star Wars stream. Yeah. And met us through the Star Wars thing? Oh, yeah, yeah that's true. That's right, yeah. 
because Kendra was was doing the stream, I commented, and then Dylan was like, "Get this, get this asshole on." I, I want to know who he is. Okay, okay, but th okay, there's a tiny bit more to that. Get this uh, asshole uh, on. So it wasn't just that you commented; uh, it was that you commented, and then Dylan went into full Facebook stock mode <laughs> yeah, uh, no, and went through did. all of your post history and was like, oh, this guy is posting about Geek and Sundry uh, and other live streaming things. That, uh, that and sense. was like, oh, okay, we need him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It actually started off with like, he looks hot. Click on the profile yeah. picture. Go through those stock photos. Stock time. Yeah. I like what I see. I like what I see. It's like I can I can market this. I can sell this. Yeah, so yeah. I, yeah. Uh, and then uh, you sold it by your pretty face and you have gone to my heart. By your, uh, it's gotta, I, I, I still need to work on the hair. The hair? Oh, you put gel in it today. I did. Oh. I did. I tried something different because I usually I'm pretty lazy. I'm gonna be honest. Uh -huh. uh, I work in film. I kind of just bounce around all over. Mm -hmm. uh, I do everything from like PA work to like AD work. I'm trying to be a director and other letters. Yeah, all, all these other random <laughs> things. No DB. NAACP. CCR. But it's really just like a giant mush of things. So you know that's. Film is pretty much my life, and uh, we're all nerds, so we immediately got along. And uh, after yeah. joining the team, I was like, "Yeah, this is definitely a good way to like, pretty much create another home for for nerds, especially here in New Mexico, since like there's not a lot to do out here besides either be inside and drink, or go outside <laughs> and and possibly drink." We should really incorporate <laughs> drinking into these things. Yeah, you know, I feel like it should be a bit of a drunk podcast. A little bit, yeah. 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 Sometimes, yeah, we, we should definitely... Because I was telling, uh, we did Mario Kart and uh, Le Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild on Monday. Mm -hmm. oh, and yeah. I was telling Kendra this on uh, the car ride over, um, that <laughs> there's uh, my friend uh, at uh, one of my jobs, uh, Gilby, he was telling me about um, Birio Kart. Ooh. Where you have you you open a beer at the beginning of your race, everybody has to finish their beer before the race ends, but you can't drink and drive. So you can like speed ahead, you can drive, do the race, oh but you have to gosh. pull off to the side of the road and then like swig your beer and then continue to drive, or you could just pound it immediately. That's and then do the do the race. Wait, so can but I you switch? have to finish the beer before the race is over, and you can't drink and drive. Can I switch uh, between with, with shots instead of a drink? Your funeral, man. But <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was, it's birio cart, not uh, not shot of death. Margarita cart, or uh, yeah. <laughs> Although, Carbon hey, maybe cart? we should mix in margaritas off to the side and play in a children's video oh, game. That'd, that'd be, be cool. amazing. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen Geek, Geek and Sundry um, live stream that. Do something like that. Uh, yeah, it's really it's really fun. Yeah, they use like they use like like uh, se what are the Seven Eleven? Um, big gulps? Not a big gulp, but the the a Slurpee. 40? Slurpee. Oh, yeah. sl oh, Slurpees okay. Oh and uh, they ah. get brain freezes, so it's really fun. To watch. Oh god. Brain freezes has got to be one of the top ten worst things. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I know people lose limbs and stuff, but I mean that's like <laughs> that's got to be lower than brain freeze. <laughs> that guy who like yeah. fell in that crevasse and you had that rock on his arm and he had a saw it off yeah, yeah not yeah, as bad no, yeah. as a brain freeze that was no, still yeah, the worst no, still the worst um, <laughs> like a paper cut oh god <laughs> that ruins my whole month oh my god that still understands it uh, i just wanted to mention uh yeah if you guys have any questions for us feel free to comment on youtube twitch or facebook yeah we are uh, watching them live yeah. yeah definitely comment and field, uh, field those questions yeah so what are we doing here? Why? Why? What are we? What's our goal? But yeah, let's talk about like the color, what circuit color circuit's goal is mission statement. Like if we were stuck, we're not like fisting it, are we? Yeah, it's it's really strong. I was up until this moment, and I'm going to stop. Thank I was you. Do some um, like fingering, and then maybe into a fist. You want to ease into like, it? Yeah, I, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah immediately go definitely. Into a uh, I was wrong to start with the fist. You were wrong. <laughs> yeah. Nobody likes that. No, that's, I think that's I mean, it's really aggressive. There's no, that's a lot of terror. And that's not me. Know. I'm not a fisting sort of. I haven't used my You're fist not? for much. No, I feel like like when I met you, I was I like in my head. It's a little. That's heavy what handed. I. Yeah. That's what I thought. I was like, yeah, this guy's heavy handed. <laughs> <laughs> <Ready to go. laughs> well, you're not wrong. Yeah. Um, but not in that way. How about we, what we can do is um, ask what everybody. I mean, we're all on the same page, I think, of where we think this color circuit programming channel will go. Yeah. But what do you guys want from it, or what do you expect from it, or how do you see it growing? Um, for me, I just 
want attention. That's obvious. So That's, obvious. Yeah. This is news to me. <laughs> yeah, I just, I need it all the time. <laughs> uh, and I didn't really have an outlet. That's not true. I have a lot of. You have a lot, you have a lot of, of outlets. I, I and it's not. I do we're, murder we're mystery. Uh, it's do. not enough. Yeah. It It'll is, never yeah. be enough. It, uh, nothing will ever feel. Uh, nothing will ever <laughs> fill the void. Uh, I'll, I'll just keep I know a guy with it. a fist. I'll keep cramming it in. Hey. I got two fists. <laughs> <laughs> Double fist. Woo! I only got <laughs> one effective open fist. Uh, I don't know. This is gonna we don't have an HR department yet, so this is how <laughs> I feel like we, we get all this stuff out of the way, out of the way now. Yeah. This yeah, could be the podcast. We objectify as much I, as possible. I feel right. like you just yeah. stole that joke. I feel like I heard I, that recently. Because I said it before. Oh. I said it like a week you ago. You stole it from you. You stole it from yourself. That's I'm fine. Like, where did I hear this You can recently? do that. So I'm really copy that from from <laughs> Steal it from yourself. That's fine. You can I mean, do it's that. Okay. Yeah. 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 It's totally legal. I mean, unless you sue yourself. Or I. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> don't throw off. <laughs> okay. So. What do, what do you see from Color Circuit, Dylan? Uh, Excuse me. Okay. This is really your baby. I will say this is kind of my baby. Uh, well, let's talk about inspirations, really. I am a huge fan of Geek and Sundry, mm-hmm. of Nerdist, Hyper RPG. The Attack. There's a lot of really good shows, and most of those shows stream on Twitch because that's where the fan base is. Yeah. Board gamers, tabletop gamers, role playing. Yeah. Um, a lot of improvisers tend to hang out in those uh, circles. Um, actors, uh, voice actors, for some reason too, which we got a couple at the Love table it. here. Yeah. Um, and I, I'm obsessed with it. I watch it all the time. Um, I particularly. Th- like Nerdist and Geek and Sundry, Chris Hardwick and um, Felicia Day's channels. Um, and they uh, are incredibly smart and started started uh, not s- branching out from what they kind of originally intended, at least. Maybe Chris Hardwick more so because yeah. what yeah. he started off as a podcast. It right? was al- actually Nerdist.com was a blog. It was a blog. And then he started the podcast. Okay, pop culture blog, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It was all the stuff he liked, video games, music, comic books all that stuff uh tv shows and he was like let's do a podcast and then that begot so many other podcasts and now it's this like he puts on the website a multi-headed beast yes yeah. yeah, and, and it's a, a news outlet it is a you know they they do blog about pretty much everything that they do videos about so it's all it's amazing you know, man, yeah. amazing uh, yeah. i'm gonna interrupt briefly uh colton says scott <laughs> hey, I know him too, Colton. Uh, and, and Danger says, Color Circuit fucking rules. Ooh, that's all cat. Uh, Ouch. With not one, oh. not two, How many? but three exclamation points. Thrice Whoa. exclaimed. Oh, oh, oh. Hot damn. <laughs> How do we know Danger? Uh, how do we know Danger? I don't uh, Danger is the owner of Open Source Comedy. Plug. We're plugging for yeah, him. Yeah, we're plugging for him. The plugging. only stand-up comedy club in Albuquerque. Check it out. Awesome. And it's a club, right? Like, I, I don't know. Do you have to pay, like, a membership? No. But you can. And it's definitely worth it. Okay. It's black tie only. Uh, yeah, you gotta be really you, you know uh, Actually, though. you have to bring, like, a club with you. Oh, it's a literal <laughs> club. Yeah, it's a oh, fight okay. club. Oh! So you bring a club. Okay, so he. No, there weren't. They weren't comfortable that way. I knew. <laughs> I was aware that I was wearing them backwards. It's uh, sure. a logical choice. Well, thank you, Danger and Colton, for checking us out. And yeah, uh, thanks, guys. no keep, YouTube. Keep and on Twitch. doing it. Oh, I've been checking. Uh, uh, what, so what did we get? Oh, so we left off with with Chris Hardwick, and it's a great website, blog, news outlet, um, and then they started doing. Twitch a long time ago stopped doing it for a, lo- a, a, a while longer. Maybe wait, Nerdist? Maybe. You mean? I'm sorry, Nerdist. Yeah, Nerdist, Nerdist started doing Twitch. What did I say? He said Twitch. Said Twitch. Oh, anyways, they, Nerdist started doing Twitch. They stopped doing it and then they started it again. And they have a lot of really good programming. That's kind of the idea. You know, it's a little bit of a stolen idea of what we're trying to do here. Sure. Same thing with Geek and Sundry. They do, they do a lot of podcasts. They do a lot of game playing. They do a lot of uh, impro- uh, improv Remember, right? now. Uh, well, they do is- like. This is still rather new in comparison, though. Like, we're, it's not like we're we're not like the newest ones, but we're still we're kind of fresher to the band. Nobody sure. knows what I'm doing. Yeah. Like, I tell people, oh, my friends and I start a streaming channel, and I was telling Dylan this the other day. I work at a literal television station. <laughs> like, <laughs> no clue. It is this this in- industry has been around for decades, and 
they know what they're doing. It's all professional. They have, you know, professional graphics and editing and writing and everything. And uh, and I'm like, yeah, I'm starting a streaming channel. They have no idea what this is. One of my coworkers asked me how my sex cam was doing. Oh, God. Oh, wow. That's, how that's is different. It? That, you, I'm trying to get off the that? ground. <laughs> be our new program next week. It's more of a one-man show right now. But, um, so, um, can, I ask, can I ask a question, Dylan? Yep. Uh, so is really your only goal of creating Color Circuit uh, to get a job at Nerdist or uh, That's Geek and Sundry? what I would, I would like. Be, I mean, I wouldn't be either. Geek and Sundry Nerdist. I see you. <laughs> do you see me? Do you see me? Do you see no, me? No. Do you Still no? See me? You don't course, see me? Do you okay. see me in the shower? I would be lying if I said I wouldn't enjoy working there. Oh, Here's yeah. the thing with a lot of those 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 jobs, though, is that um, I don't think these people are uh, have um, – what's the word I'm trying to look for? I think they're just like contractual um, – hmm. Oh, God, what am I trying to say? A freelance? They're like freelance workers. Yeah, yeah. they don't have. It, it's not steady. I know a lot of those people lose their jobs and they gain them. And like, sure. you got to be pretty good in the industry. And then they like end up writing on a TV show because I yeah. mean, it's all in LA, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. It's all centralized in California. California or Texas are like the two big places for that type of stuff mm -hmm. right now. Hyper RPG is pretty great. There's kind of a spinoff in that they, uh, the showrunner, ex-showrunner of uh, Geek and Sundry created his own channel. So now that's out of Seattle, I believe. Um, mm -hmm. And that's another great one. But they just opened a west, uh, uh, a southwest location in L.A. Um, but, yeah, so to answer your question, no, of course not. I, it partially is that I get to hang out with all of you guys. It's yeah. super, super cool. Yeah. It's an excuse for us, really. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we get and to be nerdy together. And mm -hmm. we can be able to see, like, you know, watch uh, us and possibly gain an audience. Well, we get to pretend that we're working. Yeah. Mm -hmm. while, yeah, I mean, a this is while a playing games and uh, talking to each other right now. Is, yeah. there, is it, there a false sex, false sense of product uh, of um, productivity? Yeah, uh, yeah. Accomplishment. 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 Accomplishment? Sure. Yeah. Well, no, I mean, this we we put in a lot of work with we this. Do. We yeah, don't we do. see any return. We put a lot of money into this. <laughs> Uh, and time, and you know what? I don't even know what my aunt and uncle Bob and Jenny disrespectfully <laughs> look like, <laughs> even though I picked them up at the airport today. Um, I've forgotten what they look like. Um, so, yeah, like That's we put a lot of our time into this and a lot of our creativity, and so it is work. And so, yeah, it would be great if this could be like an eventual focal point of my professional life. Like, yeah. this is what I do. I was I was on the ground floor of Color Circuit. <gasps> you were? That's right. Yeah, what's a uh, Color Circuit? What, That's my what, painting uh, right there in the hallway. What uh, What was your aunt wearing? My aunt was wearing. She, she wears great colorful clothing. She, she, uh, she's a great shopper. Um, that doesn't answer your question. Yeah, colorful, colorful clothes. Um, Dang it. Um, <laughs> light, because, you know, she was, it was a travel day. She wasn't, you know, wearing her... Tell us more about how your aunt's a great shopper. Yeah. She's a great shopper. She, she, does she bring you shopping? She Shopping? Does she bring shopping? the shops? Shopping? Did I say earlier? Did you bring me shopping? Um, <laughs> did you go to the market, bring me shopping. Um, no, she will. Like, she will actively find things for other people and be like, oh, I saw this and thought of you. She's oh, that's great. Really nice. She's perfect like that. Yeah, yeah. Um, much to the chagrin of my um, uncle Bob, who wants her to, you know, reel it in a little bit. But you know, that's just that's just married uh, joy. You know, oh, yeah. sounds like fun. Stop spending my money. That sort of that they they're both independent um, earners. <laughs> um, like it's, it's not like one. <laughs> they make their own money individually. They're they're good people. They're smart. Um, I don't remember exactly what my aunt was wearing to answer your question to answer your fine? question yeah that's fine <laughs> <laughs> does anybody else have any other visions outside of i well for me i would definitely love to kind of build a group of as, as we said earlier of voice actors because voice acting yeah. has always been a love of mine like i i think i i picked up a, my first audiobook like three or four years ago and that just like became my life and then realizing that a lot of like you know, anime artists, video games, yeah. like they they all have a lot of podcasts. Because, of course, I mean, if you have a good voice, people want to listen to you use say it. stuff yeah. all the time. Yeah. yeah. And so that's always been a giant thing for me. It's like trying to build that community. 
along with like possibly starting a publishing company out here. Not really sure because hmm. there's there's always what there's always room. Uh, just uh, audiobook publishing. Okay. Because it's like if we had a subsidiary of Audible here, that'd be amazing. Yeah. Yeah. And cause... that they're like the kings. Like they're like yeah. the new mm -hmm. the number one. They are like audiobook. number yeah. number yeah. one. Yeah. Couldn't they be like the queens? I mean, sure. They can be kings and queens. Yes. I'm in Seattle. I don't know. <laughs> it would be a kingly so place or queenly your place. <laughs> Score one for the one girl. That's, That's right. Point. So, so you have you have a bit of a background in audiobooks. I do. I do. Um, I have been doing audiobooks for about uh, two years now, and uh, I go through a different name just because I didn't know how long I'd be doing audiobooks for. Mm -hmm. And it's it's served me well because I've had a chance to uh, really just delve into characters and really understand who I am as a. Where voice did Bond actor. go? Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and it's been really fun. We're that, we're that kind of show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Doing something different. But uh, yeah, it's like audiobooks and that sort of thing. Like that, this type of podcast commentary has always been a big thing when it came to watching my favorite video game. Or like players like twitch players mm -hmm. like keep on going and like seeing my voice actors going like yeah just finished a project like critical role was a giant thing for me where mm -hmm. i was like all of my favorite voice actors right now are doing D D. oh my gosh i have super nerd upon super nerdiness happening right now i want to get in how do i do this right so and this is so this is one of the ways potentially. yeah this is this is a potential like venue to like explore and and try all these different things that you know most people don't really do here so this is why I love it so much. Do you? Uh, uh, you said you go by a different name. Is there any? Do you want to pimp out any of the books that you've read? I don't. You don't. I okay. really <laughs> don't. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Can we you should... give us the genre? Uh, the genre is uh, romance. romance. So imagine this voice yes, talking um, to you. To I'm here to romance you. you to sleep. Tell you that everything's fine, darling. Don't worry. We'll stop those vampires. <laughs> They'll never be able to stop us now. That corset needs to come off. Yes. Slowly, let me help you unbutton this. Yes, it, it's As he took her. each one. Yes. Uh, it hurts she, her. She can hardly she breathe. Probably, <laughs> oh, probably help no. her out of it. But Damien, I don't know what I'm going to do. Shh, 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 shh. Don't say a word. Don't say a word. Shh, shh. It's, 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 it's caught. It, it, oh. It's not. Uh, what if I use oh, my teeth? No, I, no, I, just don't. No, it's, it's okay. No, you don't. Bad damn! For your it's oh, bad for your damn! Oh, no, it's just. I chipped my teeth on the little metal bracket. <laughs> oh. Just, I swear, it's gonna be fine. No, I have a tool. I have a tool. Just let me, just let me go over here to. And then she reaches for, and then end scene. I'm gonna sit right there. <laughs> so to answer your question, my sex cam is going great. It's going, it's oh, going yeah. really good. Yeah. Um, it's a winner. Uh, so I. <clears throat> I've noticed that I'm a lot shorter than the rest of you, and I wish I would have put a pillow on my chest. Oh, some phone books? I, uh, I actually That's am not this tall. I have my my, my foot. Oh, extensions? Oh! oh. <laughs> That's very smart, smart actually. actually. <laughs> yeah. I'm um, actually shorter, because this is like this is where probably I, where I, I, I naturally I, sit. I, I think the fix is raising the camera. We didn't really think about that. Oh. But because these are pretty much at eye level, yeah. I know this is all tech stuff that shouldn't be on it, but yeah. we love to raise the camera. That's the fix, right? I think so. Yeah. yeah. We'll um, Make a note. So well, next time. Will Bolt yes. liked my sharing of the video. Wow. Ah. Um, and I think that that is uh, another step. In the in, right direction. In my master plan to make him my best friend. <laughs> okay, so um, why is that a, a goal of yours? Um, I, because he seems mysterious <laughs> and, uh, it isn't always willing to open up mm. to mm. others. Um, and I just want to be like one of those special people uh, that he opens up to. It has really nothing to do with him. It's all about me. Yeah. Will Bill is a local yeah. stand up and improv comedian. Yeah. And uh, I, after International Tabletop Day Saturday, I, I friended him on, on Facebook. Ooh, how's it going? He is letting that request sit. I think he <laughs> let mine sit, too. Yeah. Wow. Will Bolt. Will. We just want to be friends. I am, I am, Cameron Bolt. I think he's a great, funny person. I, he, he's a part of B Team at the Box on Friday night. Yeah. Very funny individual, along with four other very funny individuals. Um, and he's not... Uh, so he's letting the friend request sit in his box. I think this just goes to show that mystery behind this character. Yeah, like, 
I, I mean, yes, we don't know each other Who very are well. You, I shook his Who hand as he was leaving. Happen? That's no connection. Maybe it was too bold of me <laughs> yes. to, ref to friend request him so early on. This is true. You're the Romeo to his Juliet. Yeah. Slowly. Uh, I don't know about that, but. What up, what up? I don't know if I spelled that correctly or not. Um, so. You spelling shit over there, Max? <laughs> Do you, you guys some words? have any. I'm a, I'm a terrible speller. <laughs> Just the you, words you, on my you've thing. talked about how you want to put together some voice acting stuff. Is there, do any of you have ideas that you want to do moving <laughs> forward um, hmm. that we haven't done already? Because what have we done so far? We've done video games. Yes. We've video done game. RPGs. We've done some role playing. And some tabletop games. And, and this. Tabletop. We did a seven and a half, half hour, hour stream. Yes. Good. Yeah. Oh, uh, it's a long day. That for International long Tabletop long. Day, that's, yeah. I think, put on by Geek and Sundry, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. But yeah. that was so much fun. Yeah. It was a great time. We had our friends come in in and swap out so it wasn't just like four or five of us all the time mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. we had some great moments uh that uh <laughs> have become legend in our friend group now yeah. because of what happened uh so in my quest to become best friends with will bolt uh we're still we, talking we did we did it always goes about, back to will uh, bolt. dead dad cam oh okay yeah uh, oh, that's right, and that's right. how he not only has one dead dad but two that's a lot of dead dads. Real, wow. real dad and stepdad. What a weird pissing dad. contest that is. <laughs> really, uh, that's a really strange oh, we just have one, one dead dad? <laughs> well, I can stop that. Yeah, so <laughs> he's now going to be the, the leader of that club that Tito and I are a part of. For those of you that don't know what dad, ca dad cam, it is this camera. Um, it's seen a lot of is, shit. Yeah, it's seen a lot of dead dads. Yeah. And it is... Uh, I'll, we'll post a link to the at the bottom of the page to, some to give stuff. you some background yeah. on that. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, that was one of the the, the best moments of the day. It's a highlight, our, right? Our, Smack in the middle. Inaugural stream day, which was this past Saturday, we fit 14 people into this tiny ass apartment. Mm -hmm. That was a lot of fun, even though it, it felt cramped. Yeah, a little chaotic, but it was perfect. We yeah. had really funny moments, and you know, I got to learn some board games because i again this is out of my wheelhouse yeah like the board I'm, game stuff is the board game stuff i'm more of a, a video gamer person and um again yeah the video stuff the tabletop games the my first role-playing game was call of cthulhu and how'd, it, was, how'd it go it was super fun it was way fun um you got to do voices you got to really um you know a actually figure out how to do things and make the game go forward by yourself like that's you're not dealing with a game board where you're just like i just follow the Candyland square yeah that's my extent of board game knowledge it's very um <laughs> yeah. and uh no it's like you have to use your brain a lot more and your creativity and it's yeah it was super fun so i want to do more of that that was put on by our amazing that's right uh, game master kendra game master kendra something i never know what last name you want to go by and you have way too many instagram accounts it's just <laughs> all the choices. How many Instagram <laughs> accounts? Just two. Yeah, just three. two? <laughs> three? I, think, no. I what? think there's three. Jesus. Christ. Thank I'm you, there's sure. three. I don't mean... And they're all evenly used, too. You yeah, don't they use... all have, oh like, my goodness. ten photos on them. I I think I used my my Instagram accounts four years ago. I think that's the last time I... Or really? Like two no, years ago. Really? Yeah, I don't yeah. Instagram. Uh, really? So uh, you guys strictly use Facebook, is what you're saying, for social media? Pretty yeah. much, yeah. I Instagram I am. I'm not, like, a very sociable creature on social networks like everything i do is very much in person mm -hmm. or through text so it's Weird. like yeah i can't i don't like that i just Ma, yeah, i don't have an online presence it's yeah. not my thing that's something actually that we haven't talked about not only are we huge geeks and we love geeky stuff like board games and video games and and the like and pop culture we're all comedians to some extent right yeah, or yeah. we do comedy if you will uh, we are performers so that's, you know live theater um and or stage stage work is something that kind of brings us all together. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, what's your background? I feel like you probably have the no. As far as stage performance, probably you. I want to hear Bond's story. Time. Yeah, <laughs> that's like a that's a long time. Oh, um, too much. That's too much. I don't I don't know. It's like a, it started with a uh, start. Of course, like any other token Asian, I started with break dancing in high school. <laughs> I did too. Uh, actually. <laughs> is that part of the yeah, stereotype? I uh, was not aware of. Yeah, yeah, I was a break dancer for about two years. And what then was the I name said, of your crew? Did you have a crew name? Oh, uh, we didn't really have a name. Okay. Because we were just we would just do talent shows, and everyone just knew us. Mm -hmm. And then it was just like, all right, we're just the cool guys who do like break dancing all the time. That's what we your poster said. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, as I got into college, I started uh, doing ballroom because the girl I was seeing at the time was like, you should do ballroom, and I'm going to make you now. And then, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And then after that, I started to get into theater and into uh, musical theater, especially. And my first musical ever was uh, was Jekyll, no, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. And super fun. Uh, scariest thing ever to audition for because they had me audition by literally uh, raping the girl who played Lucy. As like the first, that's the first okay, thing so I did. so when you use wow. the word literally, I don't think you know what that means. <laughs> I mean literally. I mean, they were like, that was you, that. this is like, this is your, you're able to rip these clothes and we need you to be as ridiculous as possible. So like I pulled her hair and I was like, I don't know what to do right now. And in my head, I'm like, I'm fucking terrified. Is this what theater is? Because I don't know if I want to do this or not. How and old like, were you? How old was this? Um, I was, yeah, I was in college. So okay. I was like, a, I was like a nineteen, maybe. Okay. Eighteen, nineteen. Okay. And I was a pimply, awkward, like break dancer kid who did like parkour in his free time. So I, I was like, parkour too. <laughs> 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 so you can't get any more token. It's like I'm just so wow. like randomly into this. Like I'm totally gonna do this. I'm gonna try this out, and then we'll see what how how this goes. And then they're like, Yeah, you got the part. And I was like. Wow. And now you're a sexual fiend. <laughs> yeah. And now I just have BDSM for everything. Yeah, I have like yeah. a sex Jeez. wing and like all these toys. They're just scattered everywhere. Thanks, acting. <laughs> <laughs> just made me a deviant. All the girls just love you. Thank you so much, theater. It's just <laughs> but like after that, wow. um, it's, it's now been like, I guess, four or five years of musical theater. And then two or three years of regular stage along with doing film. And uh, also doing Rumble, which is how me and Kendra first met. Yeah. And that was musical improv mm -hmm. of, of sorts. And we did, like, uh, little sketches and uh, dancing. And, like, we just we did a, a mixture of things. It was like a, it's a fun bag of stuff. And then ever since, I've just been doing stuff like this. And a musician. And a musician, yes. And then music uh, was involved because I was a jazz singer also when I was in high school. And uh, I also played uh, trombone, jazz Jeez, trombone. Man. Jack of all trades. Yeah, yeah. Wow. No, like that's why like uh, entertaining has always been a part of my blood. Like my parents were singers too, hmm. so it just kind of felt natural for me to do this. But I just kind of jumped in everywhere because I had no idea what I was doing. And like film and theater and that sort of thing just kind of was where I just ended up being most comfortable. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes yeah. Sense. yeah. Do who who would have the second most? Uh, as far as like performance, I feel like it's Kendra. Or Kendra. Well, Scott. Oh, yeah. So it started um, when I was a toddler. Here we go. Oh and my God. I used to do beauty Just pageants. Shut the. Really? I did beauty pageants and modeling. Really? Yes. Yeah. Wait, is that true? Yeah, that's true. Really? Yeah. Wait, were you like those kids that were like pimped out? No, no, like no, 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 no. Like uh, a Jumbane. So I looked like uh, Shirley Temple. Like, that was my kind of thing. Okay. Uh, and I really loved it when I was in New York. And then I moved to Florida when I was 10. And uh, my mom brought me to a beauty pageant there to, like, sign up for it. And all of the girls were, like, wearing... The ones that you see on TV. Yeah, they oh. were, like, wearing mm. tight clothing and Super had way too much makeup yeah. on. And I was like, Mom, I want to go home. Yeah. My seven-year-old so cleavage she, is yeah, enough to smell. Yeah. She let me uh, <laughs> bail. Okay. Wow. It. So that that ended that. Uh -huh. uh, I started doing theater in middle school and did it throughout high school. Went to district competitions. Really? Mm. Yeah. Mm. I did uh, you do like uh, speech and debate and all that stuff or nope. just drama stuff? Nope, just drama stuff. And I was in art club and writer's club, all of the, like, the cool artsy things. Yeah. Uh, and then I really got into comedy when I moved here. Because uh, my roommate had just started Comedy Question Mark. Okay. And so I joined Comedy Question Mark. Um, Comedy Question Mark was an amazing improv group. You guys were so funny. So when we started, we were just a sketch group. Okay. Um, so I joined when it was just sketches. And then we grew to do sketch and improv. And then we started doing sketch, improv, and stand-up at our shows. Uh, and then they started doing just sketch and improv again. And then by the time it ended, it was just an improv group. Hmm. Uh, so it went through some different phases. Why did it dissolve? Because um, Sarah Mowry moved away. Mm -hmm. and she then, was the glue. Uh, yeah. Uh, it just fell apart. It was fine. It's nothing like dramatic. 
hmm. for sure. It just stopped. So you moved on from Comedy Question Mark to? Uh, Rumble. Rumble. Um, I've done a lot of other stuff, too. I've had, like, the Murder Mystery Dinner Theater show, The Dinner Detective. And you've been doing stand-up for how long? Three months. Three months? Really? That's I that new? Yeah. Oh, I, I thought you were had She had done it stand-up. before, but only once. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, I see. Uh, and it is definitely... I'm, I'm sad that I didn't start it sooner. Sure. Because I love it. You're really good. Thank you. I really like your stand-up. Cool. Yeah, people tell me that all the time. Uh, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've always kind of done performing of some sort. Um, uh, my first play actually was in first grade. I remember I was sick one day, and then the day I got back to school, I was the lead in the, in the class play. Like, the whole class was doing a production of Stone Soup, which is some bullshit play they let kids do <laughs> um, where it's like everyone gets involved and it's about community and being nice to each other and all the parts were were taken but like the the teacher was like Scott's going to be the lead and I was like okay um, so that was Sister Bernita at uh, Our Lady of Fatima Elementary Middle School here in Albuquerque literally across the street literally across the street yeah. uh, when it gets to the in a few minutes we can hear the the eight o'clock bells. Ooh, those are fun. It's always bong, fun. Bong, bong. By the way, that's how you use the word literally. When you said you literally raped somebody. <laughs> oh, this guy, all uh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I get it now. I get it now. Okay, all right. So, <laughs> just me. Yeah. Okay. We're learning a lot today. I very figuratively, strongly had to fake rape. There we go. Rape. Rape. And we are not making a term for fake rape. Uh, I feel like Anywho. this is the time. Now is the time. I mean, in a comedic setting. Let's talk about other things. <laughs> you know what? I'm I'm not done with my uh, story. Yeah, my uh, audience just left us. Yeah, uh, yeah. We we're holding on to two people on Facebook. Hey, hey. Um, but yeah, so I did you know drama in high school, and I um, I had a couple of false starts. I auditioned for plays my sophomore year. I auditioned for Guys and Dolls. My song of choice was um, a Monty Python <laughs> nice, uh, famous song uh, called um, <laughs> Sit on My Face. <laughs> do can do you any of you know now? that song? Sorry, what was that? Give, give us a snippet. Yeah. A snippet. Give us a, what a, is that called? A, tid a tidbit? A, a snip? A snap? I don't, I don't know. Uh, sit on my face and let my lips embrace you. I'll sit in your face and let your love be truly. Life can be fine if we're both 69. So we sit in our faces in all sorts of places and play. We'll be blown away. I didn't get very far in the song. How old are you? <laughs> this is high school. This is sophomore year. We're singing this Wonderful. in front of everybody. People? Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> That's the way to do it. If you're going to do musical theater in high school, you're going to be freaking ballsy. Yeah. Well, yeah. Um, so I did that. And... <laughs> Uh, God, what I just sang there was the ending. I forget the beginning right now, but I um, I did. It was like sit on my face and let my blah, blah, blah. Scott, like my drama <laughs> teacher in the audience, <laughs> and I did another line, Scott, and then she like screamed it. You could hear every fiber of carpet under my feet as I walked off the stage and towards my drama teacher. And she was like, Scott, get down here. So I do that, and she's like, that was offensive. You knew that was offensive. Sit sit down. Like, she didn't curse, but she, it was in the, yeah. Um, so I did not get a role in Guys and Dolls. <laughs> the bane of my existence. Well, later that year, I tried out for The Crucible. Like, she, I, I, I mended fences with the drama teacher, um, which would be demolished. At the end of junior year, that's a whole other story. Um, but uh, and then I tried it for the Crucible. I didn't get into that. But my my junior year was my big acting year in high school. Um, but uh, and then in college, didn't do much. And it's only kind of recently that I've kind of gotten back into like actual performing and doing comedy and improv. I've been doing improv for the last year, a little over a year. Nice. But and, you do uh, perform musically. Yes, yeah, I do. I do play guitar. I've been in bands for a while. I'm currently in a band called Get Action. Uh, the singer is, does not live here in town anymore, so we're kind of defunct. Um, but we just 
finished recording an album. We're getting that mastered and put on vinyl. We're figuring out artwork now. So soon, uh, by the end of this, yeah, <laughs> uh, we'll probably have an actual release and probably play some shows. Wait, what, what's our band's name? Well, that's the thing. Yeah, we've been jamming, the two of us, yeah. you on drums, myself on guitar, and we've done some really promising like it's improvisational yeah. uh musical uh little interlude things can can i be the singer well see we haven't in, in integrated that yet so maybe she could give us a, if you can show us uh how well do you know okay. sit on my face by monty python <laughs> hold on i have to find myself and now to kendra's corner Like that. <laughs> the best part was watching your jaw. <laughs> <laughs> Which was hidden by the camera. I'm kind of disappointed by that. You had me fooled, you <laughs> son of a bitch. You had me. <laughs> like the first couple of seconds, I'm like, okay, but then it just squared out. Do you sing? Like, actually? Like, no, I go to karaoke. Okay. All right. That's something. Which is magical and fun. And everyone should join us. At some point, you guys got to Oh, did us. you go? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh -huh. not, not last night, but the, the, the time before. I used to go to the ones that are like the uh, like the little Japanese or Korean ones where they're private rooms. Oh with all my your friends. gosh, I miss There's those. There's a ton of them in LA. Those are great. Oh, I, I just it makes me feel so bad because they don't have them here, and it's just like every time I want to go to like a, a private place to do karaoke with just some of my friends, it's like, no, you you have to be a drunk with everyone else and wait like two hours to Let's sing. Let's do it a song. here. Let's do You're it so show. sober. Ooh. Why we not? Do, we have I microphones. Mean, we got. We're gonna have to figure out music. Stuff. I guess, yeah, that's kind of true. Yeah. Like I royalties mean, and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. It's that, or just we just stream it, and that'll just be. And like, that'll be it. Subscribers it is what only. It is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. True. yeah subscribers sure. only. Um, you also do radio. You didn't mention that. That's a large portion of your life. Yeah. That's a yeah. Great portion. yeah. Wow. Uh, all, all, all of these stories end in like failure eventually. Wait, why is that failure? Well, it started out promising. Uh, <laughs> I until he got like, fired. Yeah. Uh, which, let's repeat that podcast episode you did in the past. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's let's. Uh, I, I was gonna say earlier uh, because you, you were talking about. Hey, let's talk about our jobs. Let's not name names. Let's not name like actual companies and Probably stuff. Probably a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Um, anywho. Um, <laughs> yeah. No, I did. Uh, I did radio for about seven and a half years. Yeah. Um, didn't make that eight year. Uh, here in Albuquerque. I worked up from promotions to doing traffic reporting, and then I was like a producer, third mic on a morning show, and then I magically wasn't one day. Mm. Yeah, uh, radio happened. Uh, yeah. Well, syndicated shows happened. Oh. And so that show that I was on was no longer a thing, and then I was doing traffic, and you know, I'm, I'm in a much better place now. I do television, and I teach children music, and that's Sounds much great. more rewarding. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Quick yes or no answer: uh, Is radio dying? That's a big uh, loaded question. Um, it is stagnant. I will say that. Okay. Is radio, it is not growing? It is, is not. Yeah. Is radio killing the video star? It's finally getting the uh, revenge. Um, no, video star is doing fine. Yeah. Yeah. Good reference. Yeah. Uh, I guess it's my turn. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I have no background in any of the stuff that you. You're guys a geologist. <laughs> <laughs> You're a science Who man. Are you? I actually have been playing drums since I was ten. Yeah. Um. So that's as, as far as like stage performance and stuff goes. And you've done bands since then. I've been, like... I've been in some bands. Not. I, I mean, I didn't start to get into bands until I was in like college because I was too right. embarrassed to play music in front of others. Mm -hmm. uh, playing in front of people is just like a terrifying thing in general. It yeah. is. I've definitely gotten over it. And, um, you know, things like improv, like mm -hmm. over the last uh, year and a half that I've been doing, is like helps a ton with uh, with everything, with public yeah. speaking, with collaboration, yeah. all the above. Um, and so, yeah, I've been doing that. I've been doing stand up for uh, six months, something like that. Um, I I feel like I've like outgrown it. Like I'm too good for this town. I just got to start spreading, <laughs> spreading out. Right? Six months and I'm out. Six yeah, months. Yeah, I've yeah, learned yeah, everything just, I can learn. Yeah, yeah I got a bigger and better. I think is sure. The, is the, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, I've been pretty stagnant with it because I like yeah, like you said, I'm a geologist, um, and so I'm actually just thinking actually, about uh, going. Scott said that. Oh. 
<laughs> ah, the, the dulcet tones of Bon and Scott. Who's who? Who's who? Yeah, <laughs> Actually, close your eyes. That's exactly what happens. When yeah. you come over, I always think you're Bon. Really? We both have really deep voices. Is that, is that really true? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's I always think you're walking in. Yeah. But then... Right. Team same voice. Team same Team voice. Same voice. <laughs> Team same voice. Aw. <laughs> 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 Two team same voices in one like podcast. All yeah, these you're right. surprises. Our voices are closer together than these men over here. Yeah. Yeah. These yeah. men. Our deep, sultry voices. How are we, how, how are we on time? How long have we been doing this? I think we're probably about an hour. Yeah, like I, I started this uh, before we went live on the stream. We have an uh, hour and six minutes on the audio recording. So okay. um, we're, I mean, we're good. Uh, we can talk for a little while longer if you want. We can wrap it up. Does anybody um, else have any like questions? I, I do request that you wrap it up. Oh, we're gonna have to do a wrap? No, I mean just end it. No, I meant like wear a condom. Oh, we're gonna. Oh, 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 oh. This is a PSA. Yeah. Oh, I don't, I don't get sexed enough for that. That just doesn't. But what when you do, you just like. Eh. If anybody I mean, needs condoms, I have oh. some. Oh. Because every time I go to pick up my birth control, they give me a brown paper bag full, full, full yeah. condoms. No. Yeah. yeah. In a brown paper it's bag. It's like, yeah. like the 15 cent condoms or whatever. It's like, no, you can they're, get... actually, they're like lifestyles. Oh, right. That, yeah. That's fine. That's a nice. decent brand. A decent not brands like of condoms. Trojan, yeah. But... Not quite. Yeah. Well, let's rank them now that. Uh, I, don't, I really don't know that much about condoms. They're like a morning radio show now. All right. We're going to rank condoms now. Let's try. Let's put it on these bananas. <laughs> well, that also depends too on are we are we ranking them from like the most durable, so like the best condoms as a uh, effective tool, or like the best feeling condoms? Because that's also another. Oh yeah, you're right. I didn't even think about all the variables. And they can a lot of variables. kind of be exclusive. Like I was thinking better. more just like visually appealing. I really uh, appealing? only use lambskin. No. Are you allergic? <laughs> what? You just really? deny her. <laughs> it's like, no, you don't. You stop it. You no, stop it nobody now. uses lamb skin. People, Come on, Pocahontas. I right. worked at CVS. People buy those. They do. Sure. Yeah, Some people sure. are allergic to latex, right? Right. Yeah, but there are other alternatives to fucking lamb skin. There's like a lot. Like what? I don't know. I don't I, think there are. There should be. With latex and lamb skin. That's it, right? Those are the only two. I don't. Uh, so, uh, Trojan, if you want to sponsor us, um, that would be great. Otherwise, we're going to go with these lambs. Uh, uh, I don't know we, about that. Uh, wrap it up. Uh, I'd just like to give a shout out to two Justins, Justin Laird, who we all love. We do love yeah. Justin. Yeah. We love Justin Laird. Justin Laird. Justin I don't know who Justin Holub is. Oh, Justin Holub. He's a friend uh, of mine. Good. He, he built my amp. My Ooh, guitar amp. Oh, nice. Your guitar amp is badass. No, he's married. I married oh. him, actually. I officiated his wedding. Really? That's yeah. awesome. Last year. <laughs> oh, actually, Sorry, you, you want to get in on the... I'm going to a wedding. I can, I can introduce him. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> okay. You, you just like <laughs> the name Justin? <laughs> so, is that it? <laughs> I just wanted to be creepy. So All quick, right, no, yeah. I should just never take you to Vegas, is what you're telling me. I will officiate. <laughs> I will officiate the hell out of yeah, like random people. Oh my gosh. Yeah. yeah. We are never going to Vegas together because that's terrifying for me. Uh, <laughs> you I would wake up married. Away. Yeah. <laughs> uh, cool. All right, guys. I think this was a pretty successful yeah. first podcast. You get to learn a little bit about each other. Yeah. It was loose. It was goosey. It was relaxing. Yeah. It was, Everybody else it got was to learn a little bit. It was yeah. bonding, bonding, bonding time. Bonding time. Yeah, we Spots should have a second. Bond. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, like, bonding <laughs> time. You need to just like Yeah, it's uh, and then it just cuts to dead dad cam and it's just you putting together <laughs> it's you putting together Lego pieces. Yeah, just by myself. Bonding just. time. <laughs> <laughs> I bond with myself. <laughs> I remember uh, when dads do this with their kids, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's so like is, it, uh, is it sign off, sign off time? Is that, is that the idea here? Yeah. yeah. Thank you guys for tuning in so much. Uh, again, whether it was a podcast, uh, which will be available on iTunes and, and other um, apps, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, iTunes and then any place you download podcasts. Yeah. Look for Color Circuit, uh, Circuit Board. Uh, we'll figure that out. But Color yeah. Circuit, we'll Circuit Board out. Podcast. Um, again, uh, I am Dylan. I'm Bon. Uh, I'm Kendra. And I'm Scott. <laughs> and thank you guys for joining. <laughs> yeah. Share, Bye. like, and subscribe. All that stuff. Share, like, yeah. subscribe. Go check out all the social places. Bye. Bye. Love you. See you next week. <laughs>